Hey, how you doing? Talent is here. Hey, I want to take you to meet Rebecca. I got pee on my head. <laughs> I'm here to go with me. Last night we made some calls. I found Pete Dominic. Pete is from the Gotham Comedy Club. He is one of the best MCs in the New York City area. So when we look at Pete, we realize Pete has the experience. Do you have any special requests? I want three models. I want I want Jennifer Lopez there. I also want Jennifer Garner there because I used to know her. <laughs> Are you all right, Rebecca? I'm okay. You want to loosen up and need a hug? I, this is very, I, I, I know it's very stressful. Up. It's comedy. We have a great time. The best thing you did was booking me to host. I I, I can't tell you because I'm smooth. It's I can't be great. wait. It's gonna be funny and I. And I this is a very pressure-packed situation, and you just have to like follow your uh, gut and get things done. I have to make people like me, and I ha they have to have a good time. We well, are making don't, me I'll like go you home right and write now. In a journal and it's, it's gonna be great. I do this every night. We're rolling with the punches here and we're making this thing work and I'm really proud of my team. There's so many wonderful things about Yahoo that we've tried to incorporate into it. The Elizabeth Blazer Pediatric AIDS Foundation will really benefit from this night. So thank you so much. Enjoy. After Wenda, we're gonna have uh, Pete jump in and just do a quick bit. All right. Whatever it is, and we're going to have uh, Jake as well jump up there with you. So it's going to be Wenda. Whoa. This is all new. Okay. Let's definitely talk to you. I'm confused. Okay. Now, we want you up here on stage because you are the MC. All right. After she introduces Jake, she'll go ahead and go to you. So there's going to be three people standing on stage. I, gonna... I think I think coming Wenda should introduce Pete. Right. And right. Just the thing I should, is, I, there should be there should yeah. be like some poignancy around That's the introduction fine. and be right. like. Mm -hmm. I should now... be on stage and having people go, "Who's that guy in the fluffy outfit?" Huh? That's right. Or whatever. Come on, let's go. I really expected Mr. Trump to come up and say a few words to the VIPs. I didn't expect him to tell people that they should follow him downstairs for the comedy event. Trump got people going downstairs for our comedy event 30 minutes before we anticipated its start. It is kind of humorous that out of all the things, Trump ended up being the biggest wild card. Make sure people are aware that we're going to start the show any minute. Come on in, make a crack a joke or two if you want to. Wait, 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 whoa, whoa, whoa. You're putting me on right now? In a couple minutes here, yeah. One of the major concerns of the whole event was to get 300 people from upstairs to downstairs in about five minutes. Mr. Trump came, and within about two minutes, he got those people downstairs. So I had to make these comedians and MC ready to go, ready for the show. They're upstairs practicing their routine, and all of a sudden, hey guys, I know it's supposed to be 7.15 start time, now it's a 6.50, 7 o'clock start time. It doesn't go well with comedians. Wait, you want me to go on right now and make some kind of weird announcement? <laughs> Pretty much just, hey guys, the show's going to start in a minute here. Why don't you do that? I can't go on with him. Yeah, you, don't, you shouldn't see me before I go on the first time. Okay. Now it is a real pleasure to introduce to you Pete Dominic. He's a really popular guy. So Pete, where are you? Thank you very much. I want to thank you. Thank you. How many Yahoos are here tonight? That means you're an employee of Yahoo. Yahoos. Did anybody? That one guy's like, I am a Yahoo guy. I, I would like to raise my hand and let you know. I... Uh, how many? Did anybody have a Yahoo teeny? That was so cute that they named. Yeah, it was good. You had a Yahoo teeny. It's a little bit feminine. I gotta, I gotta tell you, it's a little bit of a feminine drink. But if you're comfortable with your sexuality, sure, I don't think that's a problem. And you look like you are. You've been to Europe? Yeah. Yeah. During the, the war and um, of 1492. Pete just went on and on and on, ripping George Ross. And there was a point when I was thinking, stop. It's it's enough. The man has laughed. You, 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 you effectively ripped this, this man who is judging the outcome of my team leader. Stop ripping George Ross. He's laughing. It's okay. It's a smile that I know he's going to kill me. But... Hey, guys. I'm pulling together upstairs the gift bag handout, and I'm making sure that that's all organized, that when people do walk out, it's ready to go. Awesome. Hey, also, put a smile on your face because George is down here. Folded over in his seat, laughing so hard. Jim Florentine, everybody. Jim Florentine, come on. Keep it going. Keep it going. Thank you so much for coming out here to support such an unbelievable charity, uh, the Elizabeth Glazer uh, Pediatric AIDS Foundation. And thank you, uh, Yahoo. Good night. Thank you very much. Thanks for coming.